What's good, YouTube? You know who it is. All knowing, all loving, all powerful, all damn everything. Sexy as hell, host of the Life Games channel, Lamont Tyson. And this is another how to start your YouTube channel to help you understand how to do some very, very minor and basic video editing on the Mac. That's what I use. And, you know, my personal story with this whole thing was, guys, I was very intimidated in the beginning and was getting ready to almost start paying people to edit all the stuff I was doing. Um, and some of the estimates I got from people was upwards of $60 an hour. One guy was going to charge $150 an hour to edit five to 10 minutes of recorded material and things that I had done. So I started doing my homework, um, learning how to use editing software, learning how to edit my own videos. And ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be a video, if you have a Mac, showing you how you can do your editing and all that good stuff on the program that comes on Mac. And so what I'm going to do is open that up right now and show you guys little secrets, little tips, and we're going to throw a video in there that'll show you guys how you can do your own editing. You can save that money, you can drop the stress level, and you can start editing your own videos and not have to worry about that overhead cost. So let's, let's go ahead and get on into it. What we're going to be using is iMovie. And I'm going to edit the opening that we just did. We're going to do it together. So I'm going to go ahead and open iMovie. These are some stuff I've done in the past. And when you open iMovie, it breaks it down into media, which is everything you've got on your computer, all that kind of stuff. Projects you've done, which is showing one of my last projects. And then it goes into your theater. And I don't have anything in there because every time I have... A list of projects I've done, I delete them to save space. So you're going to primarily be working from this area right here, projects. So we're going to create new, all right? You can make a trailer or you can combine that trailer and make it with your movie. I use the trailer feature, and I'll click it and show it to you, to create my opening intro with my little life game symbol and all that good stuff, my little theme music. And these are the new trailers that they've got going on that you can select from. They're absolutely free. And they now have it where you can create one. So that'll be something you guys can just kind of play with. And I'll walk you through one of them real quick so you can see what it does. So bam. It's, it just used one of my labels from my computer. Alright. So guys, you can kind of take that type of scenario and put your own material in there and use that as your um, trailer. If you want to do something like that, you can use it for your opening act on your videos, however you want to do it. So I'm going to go ahead and click in the movie. All right. And <clears throat> to get to the info on your computer, you would just click that down button. Now it's showing you my desktop. All right. And... What did I name that thing on my computer? It is, it's not that one. Let's see, edit video quick time. That's me right there. And you just click import. Okay. And my intro, my life games intro, I've already got it saved in here. So I would just scroll down and I, I got a, a tab that I call YouTube files and there's my life gains intro. So you, I just add that and also say under that same YouTube, I've got like the different theme music that I went online on YouTube. YouTube has a feature where you can get different various music for free. You don't owe any um, royalties and you can put it in. And all of my little key tags and keywords that help rank you up and all my little sayings, I've got them in here too. So there's the one I always say, don't forget to like my video. That's there. So I'm going to import that. And the other one I always tell people to do is check the description box below my video. I'm going to import that. Okay. All right. So bam. Now it's just dr drag and drop, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to pull my video right here. That's my intro. Okay. This is the video we're working with right now. All right. And the part that I'm currently recording is going to be added to, but I'm recording it so I can't put it in just yet. 
And so with just this section, you might want to add some um, transitions and the transitions tab is right here. Up here you've got your audio, you've got your media. This is my media, what I just brought in here. Then you've got audio that you can find from different artists that you have up here, but you just got to make sure that that stuff is owned by you so that when you list it, you can get paid for it on YouTube. They've got a section for you to add your own title. So let's say for instance, I wanted to put a title. You just click it, just drag it. All right, and bam, there it is. Okay, let me get rid of this one. Okay, don't need that one. And then when you highlight it, you just go right up here and just click what you want to put in it. So I'm just going to say sexy as hell. And that will be in my title, okay? Then you've got transition. So whenever you copy and cut something, you want to have something so people don't know that you just kind of switch from frame to frame. So for me, I always like to put this one to start my video. And then I put a transition separately to go there. And then with my media, I always also like to start my videos with my slogans. So we're going to put that right there. And then from there, ladies and gentlemen, the way that you get your picture to be set in the video, let me show you how you do that. So it's already highlighted in yellow right here. You would just come up here. You give that a click. And you figure out whether you want it in Ken Burns where it slides from side to side. I always fit mine to the frame. And this is what you would do to get to be a picture in the picture. So you've got cutaway, green, blue, split screen, picture in the picture. So you give that a click. And bam. I've got a picture in the picture. You can size it, resize it. That yellow line just lets you know how it's centered. If you're going off the picture or whatever and all that good stuff and just size it the way you want it and put it wherever you want it that's how people make this thing look so professional all right and then let's go back down here and highlight the video I'm trying to get this to you guys as quickly as possible let's just say um i need to adjust um let's say i want to be light skinned like michael jackson here you just hit this button look at that light as ever just like that all right Let's say I want to add some texture to the color. You just click this one, like that, okay? And let's just say I want to do a voiceover on something, okay? You just come back over here, highlight the area you're going to start at. Oops. So while we're here, this is how you control the sound. Let's say if I recorded outside and you had a lot of wind, you could just hit this button. That reduced the background noise. This is how you set whether or not you want you to have some bass, treble, those type of things. I have a squeaky voice, so I tend to put mine on bass boost so I can sound like Barry White, ladies and gentlemen. I really don't like soft drinks with fruity names. So I get y'all that bass voice. That's what I like to do, you know. Um, but it just depends on you and your video, okay? All right, and just with the gobbity goop we've done so far, let's show you guys what that would look like. What's good, YouTube? You know who it is. All knowing, all loving, all powerful, all damn everything. Sexy as hell, host of the Life Games channel, Lamont Tyson. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so you got that little tidbit. This thing does a whole lot more. This is how you increase your speed. If you want to slow it down, you want to freeze frame, you come over here and click that button. And I don't want to make this video too long, so I might come back and do a finish up to it, but just to finish it off, when I come and add my music, you just drag it down here. And then you can resize this thing the way you want it, just like that. And then you don't want this to be at 100% volume. And I'll show you what it sounds like right now with 100% volume. So what you're going to want to do is turn it down a little bit. That's 3%. All right, now listen. To edit all the stuff I was doing um, and some of the estimates I got from people. And then 
you know, if you just want to edit, you just click. Let's just say we're going to edit this section right here, okay? All right. You don't have to do any crazy whatever, whatever. You can actually let it play. So let's just go ahead and get on into it. I just hit the space button to pause it right there, all right? Then split the clip. And here you can put a transition if you was going to use that piece that you just split. Let me click on my transition. Let's just put this one there. You can put a transition there. You can delete it, which is what I want to do because I don't need that. And then my outro, because I would be done with the video at this point, would go right there. So let's just pick up from right here. There. That'll show you guys how you can do your own editing. I had to worry about that overhead cost. So let's just go ahead and get on into it. And guys, that is just the quickest, simplest run through I can give you. You can make this whole section bigger by doing this number so that you can finally detail certain areas you want to copy, paste, and all that. There are some other features that this thing will do that is a whole lot more complex than what I just showed you. But like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I don't want this to be complex for anybody. I don't want anyone to be intimidated thinking that they can't get up here and edit their own videos, especially if you have a Mac. Because it's easy, you just got to do a couple. When I first jumped on this thing, I was scared to death. I was just like, oh my God, I'm, I'm done. But I played with it for one weekend, got my feet right, made mistakes. And it took me seeing a little walkthrough similar to what I just showed you guys. And then I started adapting and doing other things with it from that point. So just wanted you guys to see that. And that is going to conclude this video. Don't forget to like my video, ladies and gentlemen. Comment and subscribe. Go out there get yourself a life game. If you need further help on YouTube, starting, editing videos, hit me up at www.facebook.com lifegains07 and you can get one-on-one -on -one time with me if that's what you want to do from that page on you on Facebook. And we will see you guys on the next Sexy as Hell video. Till then, gets to YouTube.